With temperatures going to be staying cold for a while here, you're probably staying inside more with your dog and with your family and whoever else. But Mary Green of Canine Manners and More is here to talk about specifically what she says are some indoor manners for our pets. So Mary, welcome right. back. Nice to be here. Thank you so much. So I don't know if you saw the forecast. <laughs> I saw it. Uh, pets are going to be indoors a little more here. Coming and they up. should be exactly. It's just going to it's too cold for pets to be outside. And I think sometimes what the problem is, is people their 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 dogs in particular are either outside or if they're inside they're crated or confined and and I think there's a whole a whole aspect to to integrating your dog you know with your family activities and there's some training required to do that mm, right yes so the first and easiest thing is use a leash. You don't have to let your dog go racing through the house. In fact, I had to do that at my house this morning because somebody wanted to go racing through the house. Um, <laughs> so, you know, using the leash just to get from point A to point B and then just hanging on to the leash with the dog so that she's not just running amok and climbing on furniture and everything. That's really an easy thing to do. Um, another thing that I do is, is to kind of teach the dog where I want them to be. So we do a lot of... Um, uh, like training the dog to to go and settle on a specific dog bed or mat and maybe chew their own toy stay there and be calm in that manner so that's another thing that you can okay. do and then um, give them something to do um, I, I realize with children that we spend a lot of time saying no honey don't touch that no let's leave that alone no 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 and we do the same thing with dogs right it's a constant this is a no this is a no this is a no but we don't let them know what to do instead of so yeah. instead of getting into my stuff and chewing my things go find your toy basket Cory Bell has her toy basket has her favorite thing which is red bone and I bury red bone in there sometimes so she has to go on a treasure hunt for red bone and that keeps her occupied and it keeps her out of trouble and she's on a mission to find to find things to do in the house so let them know what they can do rather than what they can't all the time so much easier That's isn't great. it yes <laughs> and you and we were getting a close up shot earlier of this sassy new collar <laughs> i'm loving this this is truly's latest christmas gift and so uh, uh, you know, it's fun to get pets that are appropriate toys for Christmas as Absolutely. well. Absolutely. And this would not be an everyday collar. This is like a special event. I'm going to be on TV collar. Right. Yeah. I have to have my, you know, I have to have my bling on for TV, but no, that wouldn't be her, her everyday, <laughs> her everyday attire. Well, Mary, thank you so much. Thank you, Dave. And you can always email us questions if you'd like. Noon show at newson6.net.